Yo, what up, what up, this is your boy King Series. In today's video, I'm going to show you how I mix this vocals over here. So just stick with me. So I'm going to play it for you to listen to how it sounds, and I will break it down for you guys, the kind of plugins that I use to achieve this nice uh, mix over here. So without wasting my time, let's just go into it. So. Uh. Say yeah with the T. Yeah, hustling 247. Can to my bedding on my shoulder. I wanna be in heaven. I'm probably breaking me down. This is good. You shouldn't buy the VMD. Nadia, my pen will be Buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully, table will turn soon. I will celebrate. Yankee holidays. Yeah. Okay, so this is the song. If you listen to it, you can actually hear that it sounds clean and nice. It's my own song. Let me solo uh, mute all the plugins and listen to the raw nature of the vocals right yeah only the vocals then after that i'll play it together with the beat then you listen to it and see the difference then we start with the um, effect on it hustling two four seven can too much burden on my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. Tis a could you shadin' by the Vim D. Nadia, my bemu be Buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully, table go turn soon. I will celebrate Yankee holidays. Yeah. If you listen to the vocals here, the first problem that I did encounter is that um, the room is not treated. I've moved from my old studio to a different room. So um i've not settled down properly so i've not treated the room here is my bedroom studio that i'm actually showing so you can hear some echoes in the vocals when you listen to the vocals right yeah so i will just give you a trick whenever you record um, your vocals and you hear some echoes in it the way you're supposed to apply a certain effect on it so that it wouldn't sound too roomy or anything but it will sound nice like the way you listen to it right okay so that is the first problem that I did encounter. Yes, so let me play it together with the beat. Then we see how it sounds. Then we start attacking the problems, and you get to know how it feels at the end. Uh. Say yeah with the T. Yeah, hustling two four seven. Can to my bedding. On my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. I'm probably breaking me down. This a good you shouldn't buy the VMD. Yeah, my pen will be with that. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully, table will turn soon. I will celebrate Yankee holidays. Yeah. Okay, so when you listen to it together with the beat, it sounds okay and normal. Yeah. So the first thing that I did on it is um I put this C1 gate just to block some background noises. If you have been following my tutorial, you always get to know that I do this thing a lot. Yes. If your room is not treated properly especially yeah so that all those background noises could be out of the way for your vocals to be clean right after this the next thing is i always route uh, my track to a group so that i can process all of them together if there are many yeah, so the first thing is eqing you know the work of eqing i always tell you don't just copy the settings of whatever you watch or whatever you see just understand what the plugin is actually doing to the vocals right so if you listen to these vocals right now let me solo it what the eq is doing here is um the eq is taking away bad frequencies the frequencies which i think or i feel is not sounding right in my ears yes so i'm using the eq to cut out all those bad frequencies you get it yes the low ends the mid the highs and everywhere wherever you feel that the vocal doesn't sound right just take it don't copy these settings because the mic and your sound card or your room treatment your vocals is different from my own so just understand the work of this plugin and just we have so many eq that um is there that you can use so just use the one you are okay with or you are comfortable don't force yourself to go and get this one so far as you don't have uh, access to it right now just use the one you have and understand how it works okay so with and without this eq this is how it sounds so with the eq on it this is how it sounds then i'll just bypass it for you to see how it sounds uh say yeah with the t yeah hustling two four seven can too much burden 
On my shoulder I wanna be in heaven A brand breaking me down Until so could you shut in by the vim day Nyadia my bemu be Buddha No way Riches be my aim My the campaign Hopefully table go ten soon I will celebrate Yankee holidays Yeah Yeah Hustling 247 Ken Too much burden on my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. Until so could you shut in by the vim day. Nadia, my be Buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My de can. So if you can just notice the difference. If you are listening to it on your phone, you wouldn't notice the difference. But if you are listening to it on headphones or monitors, studio monitors, you could actually tell the difference. So if I activate the EQ, you can possibly uh, hear the clarity more. But if I mute it. The meaning it becomes too muddy for the vocals, right? Yes. So let's move to the next one. The next one is compressor. I always tell you know the work of the plugin that we are putting on. So the compressor is actually making our vocals even, right? So if you look at the waveform, there are certain parts that are actually louder than the other. So you are using the compressor to, I mean, bring them down so that everything will be sounding okay. You wouldn't have a certain part going up and a certain part going down, right? Yes, yeah, so that is the main aim of the compressor that we are using over here. And at times too, we can do it manually. Sometimes if you overload the work of the compressor, then it becomes hard for the compressor to do whatever you want it to. So if I want to do it manually, I can either use uh, automation, uh, volume automation, or I can just cut the portion which i think is loud then bring it down a little bit to match the ones which are actually not um playing louder yes then if i apply the compressor it's going to sound good and nice for us okay so let me just activate the compressor and deactivate then you see the difference so with the compressor on it listen campaign hopefully table good time soon i will celebrate yankee holidays say yeah with the yeah, hustling 247. Ken, too much burden. On my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. Until so could you shut in by the vim day. Nadia, my bemu be Buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully, table go ten soon. I will celebrate Yankee holidays. Yeah. Yeah, you might feel that yeah, the volume level comes up a little bit more, but it's still consistent. The, there isn't any part of the vocal that is going up and some coming down. Listen to it once again. Then we move to the next plugin. Yeah, hustling 247. Ken, too much burden. On my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. Until so could you shut in by the vim day. Nadia, my bemu be Buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully, table go ten soon. I will celebrate Yankee holidays. Yeah. That is what the compressor is actually doing over there. Then the next one is this EQ over here. Yes, to take away some of the... After I put the compressor on it, I felt that there are certain frequencies which needed to be out of the way for me, yes. So I took uh, part of the low ends again, then some part of the um, mid frequencies too, yes. So just listen to your vocals and know what you are actually missing, then you apply the right effect or the right plugin to treat it, yes. So, with and without this EQ, this is how it sounds. T. Yeah. Hustling 247. Ken. Too much burden. On my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. Until so could you shut in by the vim day. Nadia, my be Buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully, table go ten soon. I will celebrate Yankee holidays. Yeah, you can hear that it becomes more clear. Yeah. So the next thing is DS. We are just taking away the siblances. Yes, the s s s ways, right? So wait and without the DS, with the DS, when it is how it sounds, then I will just take it off. Then you see the difference. Yeah, hustling two four seven. Ken, too much burden. On my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. Until so could you shut in by the vim day. Nadia, my bemu be Buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. So listen to the riches. When I just put the DSL on it, then I will just take it. Then you see. No way. Riches be my aim. My you heard it. So. Way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. So that becomes more, right? Yeah. Then after that, I just wanted the vocals to feel. I just wanted the vocals to be warm. 
so i had to put this um satin on it from far freighter yes so it makes the vocal warm so i boosted the drive around 28 percent and with this plugging on it this is how it sounds hustling 247 can too much burden on my shoulder i wanna be in heaven or brandy breaking me down this is could you shed in bad vim day nadia my bemu be buddha no way riches be my aim my the campaign hope so somebody will ask what at all is this plugin doing on the vocal so i'm going to push the drive from here up to here then you just know what i'm actually adding to the vocals here right so let me say from here to 100 percent then this is what i'm adding to the vocals i'm adding a little bit of 28 percent to it so 100 percent this is what is being added to the vocals yeah hustling 247 king too much burden on my shoulder i wanna be in heaven yes it become too much distorted right so you just have to bring it back so that the vocals can actually sound nice more so to, i think 28 percent is quite okay for me heaven or brandy breaking me down this circle just shedding by the vim day nadia my bemu be buddha no way riches be my aim my dick so that's exactly what i'm adding to the vocal so after this listen to it with a beat and let me just move to the next plugin for you after we listen to it with the beat. Yeah, hustling two four seven. Can too much burden. On my shoulder I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. This is good you shut in by the vim day. Nadia my bemu be buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully table go ten. So I just feel that the vocals is not cutting through the mix well. So I had to use the compressor to tighten it much more. And I'm using this compressor from Waves, yes. So I have the threshold around minus 23.2. So this is the settings for this compressor. Don't copy the settings. I'm just doing fast attack and fast release. And I'm putting this on manual, yes. I don't want it to be automatic. So this is the settings that I have for this compressor. It doesn't always um, look the same. Sometimes it changes, so don't copy the settings. Just apply it and use your ears to know the difference that you are making to the vocals. With the plugin so wait and without this compressor let's listen yeah yeah hustling 247 can too much burden on my shoulder i wanna be in heaven or brandy breaking me down this is good you shedding by the vim day nadia my bemu be buddha no way riches be my aim my the campaign hopefully table go ten soon i will celebrate so the compressor i told you is for a consistent um, delivery yes you get it yeah so that we wouldn't have a, a certain part of the vocals playing louder than the other so that's what the compressor is actually doing some compressors actually add some color to the vocals especially the uh, first one that i showed you this one most of the times it add some colors to the vocals it depends on the compressor that you are using so i'm using this compressor to make sure that um, i tighten the vocals really well yes that's what it's actually doing but if i lose some volume level or gain then i mean i have to add it on the compressor here yes yeah, so that's what the compressor is actually doing for me it's not making the vocals sound sweet more or yes it's just making sure that everything is tightened up here so i just feel that the vocals is having some semblances again so i added this um what do we call it dsr on it yes so with the dsr and without can too much burden on my shoulder, I wanna be in heaven. A brand breaking me down. This is good you shed in by the vim day. Nadia my bemu be buddha. No way. Riches be my aim. My the campaign. Hopefully, table go ten soon. I will celebrate. Yeah, so it's being controlled well. The semblance is being controlled well. Yes. Then the last thing is I added this effect just to see how it's going to sound because I'm using AT2020 microphone and I tried this. Um, and trust yes and trust plugin here you just select the mic that you want so i selected road and tv microphone just to see how well it's actually going to do i'm not doing too much of it. i just selected the mic and i just felt that it sounded okay for me it sounded okay for me so wait and without this plugin let's listen if you are using a low microphone then meaning you can just go for this plugin and help you boost your um, sound of your vocals yeah hustling 247 Ken too much burden on my shoulder i wanna be in heaven or brand breaking me down this is good you shed in by the vim day nadia my bemu be buddha no way riches be my aim my the campaign hopefully this plugin makes the vocals bright more 
yeah if you listen to it well you can hear that it makes the vocals bright more yes so these are the effect that i put on it for here then we move to the reverb and the um, delay side so if you listen to this without the reverb and delay this is how it sounds after the processing hustling two four seven can to my deadin on my shoulder i wanna be in heaven or probably breaking me down this is good you said in bad of him d nadia my baby be buddha no way riches be my aim my the campaign hopefully table will tell you soon i will celebrate yankee holidays yeah nice one so for the reverb this is the reverb that i'm actually using Valhalla. Valhalla reverb and this is the settings plate and this is the settings that i'm actually using and for the delay too i'm using h delay one over four then I, this is the settings feedback of 30 i put the analog off so with the reverb and the delay on it this is how it sounds on its own uh, 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 say yeah with the t yeah hustling two four seven can too much burden on my shoulder wanna be in heaven or brand new breaking and i told you because the room is not treated with acoustic foams and other stuff uh the vocals sound too roomy yes yeah. so you need not to add too much reverb to it right other than that it's going to sound boring and it's going to sound bad right so you just have to make sure you adjust um the reverb according to how the vocals are sounding yes so if the vocals is really thick and heavy it doesn't sound roomy like this one then you can actually add a little bit of reverb to it if you want it but if you don't want it you can just back it up and make sure that it sounds okay on its own so make sure you control your reverb when your vocals is sounding roomy i mean the room is not treated with acoustic uh, panels or anything so this is the overall sound let's listen to it once again make sure you subscribe thumbs up and follow for more tutorials this is a working series yes i'm out say yeah with the t yeah hustling two four seven ten to my bedding on my shoulder i wanna be in heaven or brandy breaking me down this is good you shed in bad of him d nadia my baby be buddha no way riches be my aim my the campaign hopefully table will tell you soon i will celebrate